maybe I'm just gonna totally make this video like this one point. <sighs> like, I was friends with this person like for a long time, like more than a decade, since 1997. Someone that I was a coworker of, and I literally feel sick in my stomach talking about it. Like, I don't. I really don't feel good. But it's just like something that really bothers me is like the fact that like I, I just I hate I hate like fake politeness. I mean I get that when I go overseas. I really do. And I don't like it. Um I can't stand the fact that this person is like it's like if you really just don't want to be my friend then just be a man and freaking say it, okay? Then just say it, because I don't see you as a friend if you treat if you if you just ignore me. And it's really odd because like he had this. I, I wrote a letter to him to confront him, and I've had a few times where I really blow up about it because it gets to me, you know. If someone is professing to be your special cherished friends for friend forever or whatever, and then they blow you off, whereas before they used to uh, reply to everything you said, and spend a lot of time, you know, communicating with you, or, or whatever, and, and then suddenly not, I mean, it's like, you're not a valued person, you know, it, I, I wrote a letter to confront the person, and I pretty much was really direct, right, and he had like a Freudian slip, he had like one of those Freudian little slips, um, in the letter, because I didn't actually call him hypocrite, even though, uh, <laughs> he pretty much is being, but he he actually said uh, to come out calling me a liar and a hypocrite as a slap in my face to all the times we've known each other and enjoyed each other's company. Um, I pretty much outright called you a liar, but you're the one calling yourself the hypocrite. Um, why did you do that? Uh, and, and he started out the letter by, like, pretty much laughing at me. Um, I, it, it burns me up so much, like, I, it's like, I just, I just hate him. He pretty much, like, first, he, he goes out of his way to say, I'm not this, I'm not that, then gives this filibuster, uh, response about, like, his excuses, uh, for being whatever, but never actually apologizes it, which was what I pretty much outright called him out on. I pretty much demanded a an apology, and I demanded for him to say right out that if he really didn't want to be my friend, to just be a man and say it, and that if you didn't really want to be my friend, to apologize. For all the years of, of leading me on, making me think that he really wanted to be my friend. It was a, it was, it just sucked. And then he tries to act like he just he's just gonna brush it off. He pretty much says, I'm just brushing you off. Yeah, I pretty much called you out because you're blowing me off. You're blowing me off and ignoring me. And then at the end he just says, I'm just, I blush you off. But then he like, tries to make it sound polite and he says, I still cordial and think of you as someone special in my life. It's total bull. I, I just hate him, I hate him. You know, I am calling you a liar for a reason. If you actually thought about the reason why, why I, why I do this, why don't you think about why? Ask yourself why. Think about it. If you say you're going to call me, if you say you're going to talk to me, you say that you'll be right back, you say you're going to write to me, or you beg me, ask me, write to me some more, write to me some more, then what am I supposed to think? You know? 
I don't want to talk to you while you're on the clock. And then you pretty much say you don't have, you, you just don't care to talk to me when you're not on the clock. So that means we're, that, that you don't value me. You don't value me as a friend because I'm not. I'm not of value. Like, I totally deserve an apology. I totally deserve an apology, and you should just own up to what you did and to what you do. <sighs> I actually feel so much better now. I'm trying to think, like, what part of this is my fault? What am I... What did I do wrong? Am I wrong? Probably wrong for believing it. Probably wrong for considering it. Considering or... And treating someone so well as to believe someone who continuously lies and then tries to cover it up who doesn't really fess up or admit like this was no way, in no way a mea culpa it was basically me first and perhaps you later and clearly not total mockery I mean I know you don't care I really I know you don't care you don't you don't even you're not even gonna look at this because I know you don't. You probably never see this. I I hate you. I really do. I hate you. And I don't hate anybody. But I hate you. I hate you. I never even thought I had the strength to even say something like that. Punk. Boo. Boo. Boo to fake friends. Okay. Man, that like makes me feel so much better. Like I just uh, God, I feel like so sick. Uh. Boo. Boo. Man, Jersey people get ups really upset when you boo them. Boo. 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 Hm. Anyway. 